it's Ezzy, and today I decided to film a long overdue video. I've been wanting to purchase this box for a really long time. Before, it was actually a pink box. It was called the BFF box. And inside it had this, like, rainbow, um, like, tissue paper kind of plastic wrap thingy inside of the box. And it was really, really pretty, and I wanted it for that reason alone. But, I mean, the, in, the stuff inside the box was amazing as well. So I finally decided that for my birthday... I was gonna purchase it because it was not only their spring box but it was the their co collaboration with a very um, amazing youtuber called bunny and if you don't know who she is she is graveyard girl on YouTube and just her personality alone it's just like she's so down to earth and she's like all about being herself on camera and she doesn't care about pretty much anything and it's really really amazing that she's so open like that and it's kind of funny to watch her videos sometimes so I decided why not support uh, the YouTube community by purchasing a box from her and it was my birthday so I decided why not splurge on this box and in pictures this box looks pretty pretty big but it's actually a decently medium size it's not too small but it is pretty heavy and it retails for $29 for the seasonal box and $99 for, uh, just to pay for, like, the whole year. So, I mean, if you want the box the whole year, $99 is not that bad. Especially when it comes to what's inside this box. You're getting way more than what you paid for it. Um, and the total of this box came out to $30.99. That was including the discount code and everything and shipping. So, without further ado, let's get into this box and see what's in it. So, taking that off, and you got, this is really awkward, and then you got Bunny's, like, little portrait here of herself, which is really cute, and in the back it tells you what you've got, um, but I don't think it gives you, no, it doesn't give you any, uh, prices of how much everything in this box costs so let's get into it and then on here it gives you like ideas it tells you how to film your own unboxing so that's pretty neat so this is a tissue itself and it has little babies on it because if you don't know bunny is obsessed with dolls and little antique things and inside the box we've got just threw everything back in because I didn't like my other video. I had to refilm this, so excuse the mess. So we got the Rockin' Nudes by Maybelline. And I've ha I have had the other palette, the nude one, which was all the browns and stuff. I didn't really like it. So hopefully I do like this palette because I did want to purchase it when it came out. So we'll see how that looks. And then we got the... Um, let me put the box down. Then we got the... What is this? Skin Active um, Garnier Purifying Oil Cleansing Towels. So makeup wipes. We also got, which I'm really excited about, my little sister actually has the setting spray and I loved it. Ah, I really, really loved it. So this is the NYX Matte Finish Setting Spray. Right there. And then we have a little sample size of the Their Real Mascara by Benefit. And I love getting sample size mascaras for a lot of reasons. Um, one being that it's perfect for the under eyelashes because the brush, the brush is pretty big though. But I'm excited to try them out. This is how I became obsessed with the... What is it called? Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. I got a little sample size of it and I was madly in love. Then we all got two more little sample size things and this is the Glam Glow Youth Mud Tingle Exfoliate Treatment. A little tube about that big and then we got the Murad Essential C Day Moisture Broad Spectrum SPF 30. Right here. And it's just a little other little sample size. So that's pretty neat. Any beauty blender, um, anything. And this is the mini beauty blender. 
and it's called the Micro Mini. And it's actually two little beauty blenders in the package. So these are really, really cute. And I think these retail for $19 alone. So I'm excited to try these out because my problem area on my face all the time is my under eye concealer. It, it's just hard to pack on there and like for it not to crease. So I'm excited to get, look into that. And then we have these really cute, I thought they were really creepy at first, I'm not going to lie. They're designer nail wraps, but this is totally bunny right here, so I wouldn't blame her. And she has little dolls, and these are not your normal nail wraps. I'm just going to let you, let you guys know that right now. So if you look at them closely, if my camera will focus... You can see little babies. There's like a baby head right there, and there's a bunch of little baby heads right there, and like goldfish and like forests and stuff. So this is really cool. These are pretty cute. And I love using nail wraps because sometimes I just hate waiting for my nail polish to dry. So these are cool. And then we've got... I've never heard of this website, but Bunny talks about it and a lot. Uh, it's called Dolls Kill, and I kind of looked into it. They have a lot of different clothing and shoes and stuff like that, and they also carry a lot of makeup products. I saw a lot of Lime Crime on there. So this is pretty exciting, and it's a $20 gift card for this website. That's neat. And I'm not going to lie, I thought this was hella creepy. It's like a little keychain of a doll with, like, no foot and arms and broken and... Just really, really weird right there. So here's the doll, and it, I thought it was really, really creepy. Um, but in the back of it, it says, if you haven't heard, so there's like a little writing in the back. And I'll read it to you guys. It says, if you haven't heard, Bunny, a.k.a. Graveyard Girl, is obsessed with antique dolls and has a huge collection, some dating back to the 19th century. Most of her dolls are worn and imperfect as a reminder that imperfections and flaws are beautiful. She wanted to share an exclusive gift with our hashtag BeautyConBox subscribers, so we handmade a replica of one of her favorites and turned it into a keychain. Welcome to the Swamp Family. So after reading that, it kind of made the keychain a little less creepy, I'm not going to lie. Um, and it's just like, you know, honestly, that that is like a really deep meaning behind these dolls that she collects. It's honest, like, you know, she's going to find them broken and flawed and stuff, but flaws do make people beautiful, and this is really, really cute. So the whole idea behind that keychain is amazing. And then we've got these little head wraps, and if you don't know, Bunny loves tie-dye, so it's no surprise that some of these are tie-dyed in green and blue, so that's pretty cool. Um, what else is in here? And then there's one more thing in here, and this is the Pacifica Power of Love Natural Vegan Lipstick. And I got one in my Ipsy bag once, and it wasn't the shade, it was like a little more pink. But I'm going to swatch it really quick. Do you see that right there? This is totally my shade right here. It's like a brown color. I really, really like it. These lipsticks are pretty amazing, but the smell... The smell is not my fave. But they are really, really good and pigmented. So that's pretty much everything that comes in this Beautycon box. Um, and I mean, like I said, it retails for $30.99. And I only got it because Bunny was the one who collaborated to make this box and obviously I wanted to support her and this is really really cool so thanks for watching and if you like the box let me know what you thought of it down below if you didn't tell me why or why not um it's just pretty cool to receive um what do you call it subscription boxes because you never know what you get, you're gonna get so before I even knew what was in the box, I purchased it, and it was like all this hype about like, you know, it's a surprise, get your box before they're sold out, and all of that. So, I mean, I believe you can still purchase the bunny box, they're not sold out yet, so if you're interested, go get your hands on one, because these are honestly pretty cool. Thank you for watching, that was the unboxing of the bunny box, and I hope you enjoyed it. If you bought a subscri uh, subscription box as well, let me know what you thought about it. Or if you got some of their earlier boxes, let me know if you like the differences between both of the boxes. Um, I feel like the other box was a lot more fun looking than this one. But, I mean, the and stuff inside was amazing as well. So, thank you for watching. If 